The first step in radionuclide imaging is the preparation of the radiopharmaceutical. This must be carried out under stringent conditions of sterility. There are also strict guidelines to protect staff members from ionising radiation. The radionuclide used for most imaging techniques is technetium 99M. This is extracted from a generator on a daily basis by passing saline solution through the generator, a process known as elution. Inside the generator, an ion exchange process results in the production of a solution of sodium pertechnetate. Having drawn off the sodium pertechnetate, it is important to measure and record the activity of the eluate. In order to image a particular organ, the technetium must be combined with a substance that targets that organ. To do this, the sodium pertechnetate must be chemically reacted with an appropriate compound. Here, the technetium needs to be combined with macroaggregated albumin in order to target the lungs. To do this, the appropriate quantity of pertechnetate is diluted with saline and then added to the pulmosis powder and shaken. This radiopharmaceutical will then be ready for injection into the patient after 15 minutes. Could you tell me your name, address and date of birth, please? The patient's Charlotte identity Lott, must be checked by two members of staff before the injection is given. 10th, 1979. It's for a VQ image. Okay. They must also check the radiopharmaceutical is the correct one for the procedure being carried out. At 320 on the 5th, 7th, 01. That's correct. Okay. 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 Cool. What I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to give you an injection through here. Okay. Yeah. The injection I'm going to give you, as I said, is very slightly radioactive. Okay. But it won't make you feel strange. Okay. Yeah. Well, see, it seems slightly strange. Okay. And you may feel this just cold up in your arm. Right. But it hurt. A lead-covered syringe right. offers protection to the personnel performing the injection. The injection in right. okay. The time between the injection of the radiopharmaceutical and imaging depends on the specific procedure. In some cases, imaging is carried out immediately. In others, there can be a delay of several hours.